Lindsay Vaughn and her dog Lucy. They're here. Need to start to like, are we allowed to? I know we're okay. not allowed. To, All right, well, but I like would the, be the wrapping the around thing. you. I know. Koala I'm a big hugger on Luke eucalyptus, and you're such a tall drink of water. <laughs> And I am such a tiny one. I wear no. these deceptive shoes. I know. I do the same thing, but Lucy, really come up it. here. Lucy, you're part of this. Yeah, come here. Um, they met. Lucy and Lucy met before the show and sniffed each other's yes, butts. Yes, they are acquainted. And exactly. And they did their meet and greet <laughs> um, and found out that everything is super kosher. Yes. Speaking of how tall you are, I couldn't believe you have to wear men's skis. Well, I don't have to. I actually want to because they're better and like faster. And so I push the limits and no one else really did it before I did it. And then they're like, you're crazy. And they're laughing at me. And then I won. And then they're like, oh, maybe she's onto something. Do you think that they move faster? Do they have a different type of ride and speed and glide? Uh, they're stiffer. They're more difficult to turn. But if you can, if you have the strength to turn them, then you actually can generate more speed. So... I always was trying to push the limits and find new ways to be faster. And, you know, my, te my ski technician used to work for Bodie Miller, and he's like, well, oh, wow. you know, why don't we try some of these skis? And I was so much faster right off the get, and so that was I just, it. that was it. Cowabunga. <laughs> Something now, like that. <laughs> you know, I'm reading about you, and I'm thinking of my own daughter, Olive, who is eight, and... She is the most go for it kid, which is all you know you can ever dream of as a parent. Like yeah. she sees a giant wave and she hurls herself into awesome. it. And she runs, you know, jumps stairs and she's just that fearless kid. That's awesome. You can't teach that. Really? No, you cannot teach that. I that that's what I feel like. I mean, I I have four younger siblings and none of them were like me. Really? I was definitely different. Um, and they were, you know, very motivated and, and hardworking, but they just didn't, they always had that fear factor. Um, I just, I, something maybe is a miss upstairs, but I just don't get afraid, um, at pretty much anything. Oh, I mean, we've talked about fearless. Our word of the week last week was intrepid and it's all about being fearless. And then I question, you know, how do you get to fearless? Yeah. I know that your grandfather was a big influence on you. And I was so curious, like, what did he say to you or your family? Because I want to speak to her in the right and inspiring way to help aid her fearlessness yeah. and quell my own fears while I watch the most important <laughs> thing in my universe hurling herself into the abyss. <laughs> um, I mean, it's basically just, you know, I feel like my parents were never, they were never scared of me doing things that were, you know, um, risky. Mm -hmm. uh, my, my grandparents were, would always pray for me when I skied, but they never said, you know, slow down or, you know, this is too dangerous. My parents always encouraged me to follow my dreams and they never, you know, said that, you know, oh, girls don't do this or, you know, it was very, always very positive. And if you want to be the best, you can be the best, just work hard at it. Um, so I think it's just basically encouraging them to, to do what they want to do because kids, I think, naturally gravitate towards their passions, right? If they're not passionate about it, they're definitely not going to do it, no matter what your, your, the parents say. Um, but if they're fearless, that's, that's a great quality. Okay. You have to t tell them what can happen, you know, if something goes wrong. But if they're not afraid, that's, I mean, I, it's, it's very difficult to find people that aren't naturally afraid of things. Okay, I'm going to take that. So that's a advice. positive. Okay. A very big positive. I really, I was like, I want to ask Lindsay Vaughn and, you know, her advice on having a fearless child because my other daughter is the exact opposite she's seeing like the foam wash up in the ocean. <laughs> she's like nah, you know but that's natural like that's kind of their personality and you just got to encourage that and, and let it grow now okay the pack we have a vff wall full of dog owners know, and dog that. lovers we are dog owners and dog lovers Please tell me about this show. I mean, what a dream. Like, I know. you travel the world with dogs? Yeah. Uh, when they approached me, when Amazon approached me, I was, you know, obviously retiring from my ski career. And they said, do you want to do a global competition show with Lucy and 
12 other dogs. And I was like, yes, please. Um, it was, li I mean, who doesn't want to do that? Um, so Lucy and I got to travel with these amazing people. Um, they competed in, in different countries for different challenges. Lucy definitely would not have won any of the challenges. I can confirm that, but um, it was very fun, and we obviously enjoy traveling. She went to the Olympics with me in Korea, so like. Lucy and I are inseparable, and this was like the perfect project for us. I think this is a dream show. I think it's going to be a huge hit because people love to see adventure competition shows, but I've never seen one like this with a partner that is your dog. Yeah. And, I mean, I am going to be tuning in. This is so exciting. In fact, the pack premieres tomorrow, Friday, November 20th, on Amazon Prime Video. Watch and celebrate the amazing bond that we all have they are family. They are our best friends. And Lindsay Vaughn, you have brought something out into the world that I think all of us are going to totally embrace, binge, enjoy, <laughs> and just be so happy that it's out there because this is so unique. And thank you for the life advice because I want my daughter to be fearless. And I'm so in awe and inspired of people like you that I had to take the opportunity yeah. to be a family member who enables their daughters to be fearless because... I mean, look at you. Well, you're it sounds coolest. like you're doing a great job, so I'm sure she's going to be amazing. She already is amazing. So. Well, I'm going to follow your advice. Thank you so much. Thank no you, problem. Lindsay Vaughn and Lucy. Yeah.